guys, Matthew saying 90 here. Today is Monday, May the 1st. Hey, let's go guys. Today's the first day of May. Uh, hope you guys are having a good day today. Uh, right now, I'm at Memorial Arena right now. We're standing right next to it right now. Uh, I'm just out for a walk right now. Um, but yeah. So yeah guys, today's the first day of May. That means April's now over. It's finally May now guys. Oh, that means Mother's Day, Victoria Day, my birthday, and Rims of Ribs is coming around the corner. Like now it's getting like really close. As now there's like literally about 13 more days until Mother's Day, 21 more days until Victoria Day, 24 more days until my birthday, and roughly about 25 more days until Rims and Ribs starts. Hey! Yeah guys, it's getting really close now. As now literally my birthday and Rims and Ribs is literally at the end of this month. Oh wow. It's May now guys. Excuse me, it's officially my birthday month now. Sorry if I'm bourbon. I had lunch like not too long ago. But yeah, guys, my birthday and Rims and Ribs is at the end of this month now. As literally, it's my birthday month. Oh, let's go. But I hope you guys are having a good day today. Uh, let me know in the comments below and tell me how your day's going so far. So far, my day's okay. Uh, it's actually not too bad outside right now. Uh, it's somewhat sunny outside, but it's like a little cloudy at the same time. But it's not really that cold outside, but I think it's only like 9 degrees. So it's a little cool outside, but it's not like really cold. And yeah, I am still wearing a jacket in May. Well, it is the first AMA, but you know. But I do hope that hopefully, like within like a, ho hopefully within a week, it'll start warming back up to like nice warm weather. We can at least go out in a t-shirt or at least a sweater, because you know it is May now, and there is about almost a month and a half until summer now. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, guys, this is the first vlog of May, the new month. It's pretty nice. It's pretty nice, you guys. I'm actually really happy that it's finally May. But I honestly just cannot believe it's May. Like, it's officially May. That means my birthday and Retro Fest and Rip Fest is coming around the corner. Damn, that's pretty crazy. And I don't know if you guys can tell, but there's a soccer game over at the soccer field over there. I don't know if you guys see that, but there's some kids playing soccer. Um, but yeah, it's not too bad outside today. It's a little cloudy. A little sunny, though, too, but it's not too bad. Uh, I'm just walking around right now. And I, I did promise you guys I was going to vlog today for the first day of May, so here's the... Here's the vlog for today. And I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog I made yesterday. If you guys haven't checked out yesterday's vlog, that was when I was over by the train station and I was walking down Elizabeth Street for the last part of the vlog. So if you guys haven't checked out yesterday's vlog, the link to it will be in the description down below if you guys want to go check that out. Uh, yeah, right now I think it's like a little bit after six o'clock. And yeah, guys, the cons of it being May is that it's still light outside at six o'clock. I mean, it's not like January where it's, where by now it would be like dark outside and like really cold. It's May, so that means it's not. Too, so that means the weather's gonna get a lot nicer, and it's not gonna be as dark out as early anymore. As literally now, it's gonna get dark out around like 8:30 ish now, which is actually pretty good. I mean, it's gonna be even better. You know, next month in June, it's gonna be getting dark out at like nine, so it's gonna be even better. Wow. Yeah, guys, literally exactly a month from today will be June 1st. Wow. So now June is literally a month from now. And not only is today May 1st, but there's also now two more months, exactly, until Canada Day. Yeah, guys, since it's May 1st, that means there's now about two more months until Canada Day. Oh, let's go. That's pretty cool, you guys. Hey. But how was your guys' first day of May? Let me know in the comments below and tell me how your first day of the new month is going. Because like I said, my day's okay. Uh, we're just passing by the Fergie Jenkins field right now. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to be walking up Queen Street, which is literally just over there, and I'm going to vlog for a little bit and talk to you guys. So, yeah. Also, guys, um, apparently, uh, Brennan from Letterbomb just posted his tour for May, and Brennan's actually going to be playing at the Elephant's Nest as his one-man band on the 27th, which, if you guys have been seeing a lot of my vlogs from, like, the last few months, you know, I told you guys that 89 Next is going to be playing at Tecumseh Park on the 27th. For rims and ribs however 89 x uh they they're going to be playing from 8 o'clock to 11 p.m on the 27th 8 p.m to 11 p.m and bren usually plays with an s between 10 p.m and 1 a.m so i was kind of thinking that for the 27th uh i was gonna i was gonna go to the 89 x concert at the park first with dustin and then later after the 89 x concert dustin would go home and then because i'm most likely going to go to river rock and elephant's nest uh literally like that night so i was thinking that maybe after me and dustin see 89x at the park i'll go to the elephant's nest to see brent 
And it's even cooler is that literally the, the next day after that, which will be the 28th, uh, that's when Letterbomb will be playing at the park. Bren, Cameron, and Dylan, uh, they're going to be playing at the park for Rims and Ribs. So yeah, I'm pretty sick, guys. And like I said in a few, a few of my vlogs, uh, I am going to vlog a little bit at the 89X concert. And I figured I can maybe try and vlog a little bit of Bren's concert at the Nest. Like maybe like a clip or two and then I'll end the video. So yeah, if you guys want me to do that, uh, let me know in the comments below and I'll do that for you guys. If you guys want to see uh, 89X and Bren play on the 27th, I'll vlog two concerts. <laughs> so yeah guys, I'm technically going to go to two concerts in one night on May 27th. So like at the end of this month. First I'll go to see 89X at the park and then Bren at the Nest. <laughs> yeah. This is pretty cool guys. But yeah, guys. Now that Rich, now that Rims and Ribs is getting really close now, like literally now it's at the end of this month. I'm just super excited for Rims and Ribs. Like I'm just super, super excited. Like I'm still thinking about how the Rims and Ribs vlog is gonna go, like for the Friday and the Saturday and the Sunday. Uh, like I said before, I'll do three parts for Rims and Ribs. Part one will be on the Friday, the 26th, and I'll just be me showing you guys like downtown, like all the cold cars, and showing you guys Rib Fest at the park, and then all that. And then for part two, I'll be vlogging more of like what's going on downtown and at the park and I'll vlog a little bit with Dustin and we'll vlog at the 89X concert and then I'll do like a clip or two of Bren playing at the Nest and then I'll end the vlog like when I leave like the bars on the 27th like because I'm probably might also go to River Rock on the 27th probably so yeah. And then I'll vlog on the last day of Rims and Ribs which will be the 28th. And I'll vlog a little bit at Letterbomb's concert on the 28th, and then, yeah, so that'd be pretty cool, guys. I'm actually really excited. And I'm just really excited for my birthday, because literally now it's my birthday month, and that means there's about 24 more days to my birthday, because, you know, my birthday is May 25th, so, yeah, my birthday is at the end of this month. But I'm really hoping that by the end of this month, it'll start being, like, summer weather, which, I, I mean, I have a feeling it probably will be. Because usually every year around the end of May, like my birthday and like Retro Fest and all that, and like May 2-4 and all that, it's usually like summer weather and like I'm wearing t-shirt and shorts and it's like like 25 or 26 usually, so yeah, or 23, but you know. But yeah, I'm actually really excited now, guys. Someone was honking, I don't know who it was. But uh, yeah. And it's not really too busy out today. I mean, it is Monday, but you know. But yeah. But uh, I'm gonna pause the video for now, you guys, and I'll pick the camera back up once we're somewhere, like for like downtown or something like that, or or somewhere. So I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Okay, guys. So now I'm just walking down Queens right now. I just walked downtown for a little bit, and I'm actually heading home right now to have dinner. Uh, I'm probably gonna go back out after, uh, and maybe I might see if I can get dropped off later, but we'll see. But I'm just gonna go home and charge my phone and have some dinner. So yeah. Um, yeah, I'm just walking on Queen Street right now. Yeah, as you can see, we're kind of near the train tracks a little bit. And we're passing by the, the famous bell tower. <laughs> yeah, this is basically Chatham's biggest structure, basically. Either that or it's the ethanol plant, but yeah, I'm gonna convince that this is the tallest structure in Chatham, so yeah. Um, but yeah, guys. I was walking around for a little bit and I went to Tecumseh Park and I actually took some nice pictures at the park and I posted it on my Instagram so if you guys go to my Instagram I, uh, you'll see I posted some nice pictures at the park and I, I wanted to tag uh, Retrofest Rib Fest in the post because I figured that since it's May now uh, that means Ribs and Ribs is coming really soon so I tagged them just to let them know and all that so yeah I just thought that was cool and before I started filming, uh, I was actually listening to the band Big Wreck. Uh, they're a Canadian band, I believe, from Toronto. And I was actually thinking, I think it'd be really cool if Big Wreck played at the Capitol Theater here in Chatham. Because uh, last month in April, they were actually on tour in Ontario, and they played in, like, Guelph, uh, Brantford, Sarnia, London, I think Oakville, Richmond Hill, and uh, ooh, I think St. Catharines, I think, and Oshawa. But yeah, they, oh yeah, and Kingston. But um, yeah, recently, last month, Big Wreck was actually on tour in Ontario. And honestly, I kind of wish they stopped, they played in Chatham at the Capitol Theater, because 
We haven't. We actually. We actually have never gotten big wreck to play in Chatham. Now we got in Thornley, which is Ian Thornley's uh, old band. Thornley played in Chatham, but not Big Wreck. So I actually really hope that maybe next time Big Wreck tours in Ontario, uh, they actually play at the Capitol Theater in Chatham because I think that'd be really cool. So yeah. And if the Standstills opens for a Big Wreck at the Capitol Theater in Chatham, that'd be like really cool. Yeah. I honestly think Big Wreck should play in Chatham. I honestly think they should because that'd be really cool. And if Big Wreck does play at the Capitol Theater in Chatham, I would definitely go. So, yeah. We just passed by the Main Street Barber Shop. You can see it's right there. Um, but yeah, I'm just walking home right now. I, I Like I said, I'm probably going to go back out later and all that. I just want to go home and charge my phone and get something to eat for dinner and all that. And then I'll head back out. So, yeah. And when I do go back out, I want to see if I can go to Tammy's and get a coffee. Because I actually have a toonie in my uh, pocket. I just found out. I was like, ooh. Well, I found it. Well, I found it. So <laughs> I figured since I found a toonie, I'll uh, get a coffee. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. And I hope you guys... Uh, I hope you guys have a good week. Since it's Monday, it's the start of the week. So I hope you guys have a good week and uh, all that. It may be a little chilly outside, but hey, I'm sure that warmer weather is on its way soon. Because, you know, it's May, right? Usually by May, it starts warming up by now, so, yeah. And, I mean, usually every year, the beginning of May is still kind of chilly, like spring weather. But I'm sure, like, probably, like, a week or two from now, the, warm, the warmer weather will start coming back. And it'll stay for the rest of May and then all of summer. And then probably up until, like, the end of October, maybe, or middle of October. But, yeah. But I mean, I just hope that this October will be like warmer than last year's because you guys probably know last year in October it was like more chilly. I mean, there were some warm days in October last year, like some days in October last year, like kind of felt like summer a little bit. But um, hopefully this year's will be a little bit warmer because I actually remember uh, October in 2021 was actually like really warm. Like it was like like really warm, like almost every day. So I hope that this year's will be kind of like 2021's a little bit for October this year. <laughs> And hopefully it'll be like pretty warm outside when Crowfest happens in October. You know what I mean? Hopefully. But yeah. And guess what, guys? While I was crossing Wellington Street by St. Joe's Church, I actually saw the Trailways bus drive from School Street near the bus terminal down Queen Street. I was like, oh, I caught this Trailways bus again. And I didn't even film it again. Damn it. Oh my. <laughs> but yeah. I was like, bruh. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, it's so, still so far it's not too bad. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think about what I want to have for dinner when I get home, like what I want to cook. I want to see if I can make some chicken fingers because I still have chicken fingers in my freezer, so I might have that for dinner and maybe something else on the side, but we'll see. Oh, <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> joke, joke. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. Oh my. It's like, I gotta reload. <laughs> oh my. Okay, you wanna know something funny, guys? This is, I don't know if I told you guys this on a vlog before, but uh, last year in September, like right, it was around the end of September, uh, me, Dustin, and our friend Mike, which uh, we're not really talking right now, but uh, we were actually walking around. We were kind of over by the hospital, and there were like some guy like kind of like working on something at the hospital and it kind of made like a d -d 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 noise and Dustin was doing like really funny like things like pretend like it was like like shooting a gun and he was like I gotta reload <laughs> that was funny I was like laughing my ass off that was funny <laughs> yeah I still remember that that was hilarious <laughs> but yeah I don't know if you guys told you guys that story but that was something that's funny that happened if you guys were there you guys probably would have laughed oh yeah <laughs> yeah I actually might get a thumbnail really quick for you guys. There you go. Yeah, so we're kind of over by the train station now. So, um, but I'm gonna I'm gonna pause the video again, you guys, and I'll I'll vlog again when I'm back out from my house and all that. If I get dropped off or if I'm walking again. But next time I'm out, I'll continue the vlog. So pause it for now, and I'll see you guys later. Okay guys, so now I'm downtown right now. I'm just over by the mall right now. I'm on King Street. And as you guys can see, it's raining right now. 
Yeah, it's raining right now, and it's also pretty windy. It is actually getting cold outside right now. Like, I think now it's like five degrees, so it's actually getting kind of cold. That's probably explains why I have my hood up, because it's actually raining right now. Yeah, it's supposed to rain like all night. And it's even supposed to rain all day tomorrow and Wednesday. Yeah, it's apparently supposed to rain all day tomorrow and Wednesday, as tomorrow is a 70% chance of rain, and then Wednesday is also a 70% chance of rain. However, guys, apparently on Friday it's supposed to be sunny and 14 degrees, so eh, it actually won't be bad on Friday. And it's actually going to be even nicer on Saturday, as this Saturday, the 6th, it's supposed to be sunny, but it's supposed to be 17 degrees. Oh, guys, it's going to be really warm this weekend. I'm actually really excited. Yeah. So far, it looks like it's going to be really nice this weekend, and I really hope it stays that way. I hope it doesn't change, because if it does, I'll be kind of mad, but hopefully this weekend, it'll actually be sunny and like 14, 17 degrees. That'd be really nice. That'd be like really warm. Probably like, A. Hey. But unfortunately, tomorrow and Wednesday, is supposed to rain like all day of those two days. But I think, with, I think Thursday is like kind of like a, like kind of like a, a chance it might rain, might not for Thursday, so yeah, I think Thursday is like maybe a 30 or 40% chance, so it's like, it might rain on Thursday, probably might not, but for tomorrow and Wednesday, it's most definitely gonna rain, so yeah, unfortunately. Yeah, so I'm just out for a walk right now. Uh, I'm probably not gonna walk around for too long, cause you know, rain and all that. I didn't, I didn't want it to rain tonight, but I guess when the nature was like, too bad, it's gonna rain anyways. But who knows, but oh well. Also guys, uh, I actually just found out that this is kind of sad, but I just found out that Canadian singer Gordon Lightfoot has just passed away, like literally a few hours ago. As Gordon Lightfoot uh, passed away in a Toronto hospital at 7.30 p.m., like literally right as I got home. Wow, like, that's actually kind of sad. You know, like, that's pretty sad that Gordon Lightfoot is dead now. Wow, that is pretty sad. And he was 84. Wow, he was up there. So yeah, that's pretty sad. Yeah, I don't know what has been up with the last few days. Like, these last few days have just been, like, really weird. Because, like, you know, Saturday there was the shooting downtown. Uh, yesterday, nothing really crazy happened yesterday. So yesterday was just a quiet day. And today it was, like, kind of gloomy and a little chilly. And it's raining right now. And Gordon Lightfoot passed away. And then the next two days it's supposed to be raining all day. So these next two days are going to be kind of depressing. But, yeah. However, Friday and Saturday is supposed to be sunny, and for Friday it's supposed to be 14, and then Saturday is supposed to be 17. So hopefully Friday and Saturday will kind of make up for the last few days. You know, hopefully those days will be a little bit better, and, you know, hopefully those few days will be better, and hopefully there will be better vibes and all that, because, yeah, lately it's just been kind of, like, lately these last few days it's just been, like, kind of, like, like, a little off and, like, kind of, like, like, weird a little bit. Yeah. But, oh, well. Um, okay guys, uh, you know what, I'm probably just getting the vlog here guys, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, be sure to smash the like button, subscribe to the bell on, if you guys want to check out yesterday's vlog, the link to it will be in the description down below, uh, be sure to follow me on Instagram, my TikTok, uh, the links will be in the description down below, uh, go check out my band's Instagram, my band's TikTok, the links will be in the description down below as well, uh, go check out my real fan channel as well as my walk-in channel, the links will be in the description down below, and also guys, one more thing before I end the vlog, uh, Dustin actually just posted a new review, so if you guys want to check out Dustin's new review, uh, I'll put a link to the description down below if you guys want to watch his video. And maybe the next time I'll vlog, whenever I vlog, might be Wednesday, could be Thursday, uh, I'll hang out with Dustin, so maybe in the next vlog you guys will see Dustin and all that. Um, but yeah. Alright guys, hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.